talk about today is something that is very important to me because it came up with me recently. I found out that I am vitamin D deficient. What affects 50% of people in the United States just stick around. But before I get into the video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button because it really helps the channel. I'm going to start okay. out with some of the common signs. First off, I'm going to talk about some symptoms of vitamin D deficiency. And these are symptoms that I have personally had. I was chronically tired. Um, so tired that I just had like a dragging, tired feeling constantly throughout the day. And I consider myself someone who I eat healthy, I exercise daily, and I lift weights. And, and um, so I was so shocked. And after the workout, instead of feeling like, I, sometimes you're tired after a workout, but you, you at least have more energy. But my energy was really, really, like I had to go and lay down and take a nap. So I knew something wasn't right. So that was my first sign is just being like having a dragging, tired feeling. And I just thought, oh, I just brushed it off to being a mom. Oh, along with the tiredness, I had, um, my hair was falling out. Another symptom I had that I guess is very common as well is bone pain. I mean, my all my, like I could like feel my bones. And on top of that, I had a lot of joint pain. Joint pain, like um, the feeling of like achy joints, it, mainly in my knees and my feet. And then it went up to my, like my elbows. And I'm like, this is, this is craziness. This is not right. So, and also another big sign too that you um, may be vitamin deficient as well is anxiety and depression. As far as I kept getting sick and like when I would kick the, I would usually get the cold and I get the flu every year. Um, but when I would get a cold, it would like take forever to go away. I went to my doctor um, because I just wasn't feeling like myself. What the doctor prescribed me is um, vitamin, it's vitamin D2, it's 50,000 units of vitamin D and I take one per week and he has me on this for three months and then they'll retest my vitamin D level. First when he prescribed this to me, I didn't take it. I didn't feel the prescription because I'm someone who doesn't like to take prescriptions and I wanted to do my own research simply because I, I couldn't believe I was deficient in vitamin D. Um, so I Googled things and I, I went actually to another doctor and then I also talked to my pharmacist. I'm vitamin D now for, I'm about a month and a half into to treatment for treating my vi vitamin D deficiency. And I want to say, guys, I have good news because like four days into taking the pill, I experienced 50% um, improvement in all my symptoms. Um, the tiredness, I don't, I don't, I did, and I don't now have that dragging tired feeling. And also the, like the aching of the bones and the joint pain, that is um, about 50% gone. So I'm happy to say that it's working for me. Um, I'm, ex I'm Like I said, I'm only halfway through treatment. If any of you are having any of those symptoms at all, um, definitely go and get your vitamin D levels checked. Go get it. Go get your levels checked, and you can thank me later. Danica D's world here. So I will talk to you guys next time. Have a blessed day, and I will see you later. Bye. That's not what I want to talk about. Is if you myself young, beautiful. <laughs> Some of the symptoms, ah, for the 10th time.